How much does it really cost to make a good music video? We'll be going over that in today's video. What's up guys? This is Omari with No Nonsense Music Marketing, the number one place for music business and industry advice online. If you're not subscribed already, click that subscribe button, hit the notification bell so you get updates on every new video. Most of you watching these videos are not subscribed. So hit that button so you can act on the information this week, this month, every new video that comes out Monday to Friday. You need to be able to act on that information there's, if you're a serious musician, what's more important? Is, is it more important to keep scrolling through Instagram, keep, keep watching things that are not benefiting your music career, or is it more important to know the marketing knowledge that comes from professionals so that you can act on that information? I'll let you be the judge. Uh, so hit that subscribe button. Now, this is a trick question. How much does it really cost to make a music video? Answer, it depends on the type of video that you're trying to make. Uh, music videos in, in the traditional sense, people think of a music video as, you know, like something official. If you're old enough, it, it would be, uh, something that was on MTV or BT or VH1. Uh, and that style of video is what people tend to think about whenever we ask the question, how much does it cost to make a music video? But today it is different. You don't have to do those types of videos to be successful. So the first type of video I'm going to talk about is actually a lyric video because not enough artists make these and you need to be making these. Uh, you can still make the official music video after a lyric video if you want to, but a lot of times you you may not need to. Uh, so a lyric video can be as cheap as five bucks on a, a site like Fiverr and we'll have a link somewhere in the description, our, our affiliate link for Fiverr. Uh, and some services. I believe we have an article on our website that we've written. So we'll have a link somewhere in the description or, uh, you know, you can go to our website, look at products and you'll see uh, services for lyric videos in there as well. If you're watching this on Instagram or whatever, click the link in our bio or just go to Uh But you can have lyric videos as cheap as five bucks all the way up to maybe like 50 bucks, 50 bucks, 100 bucks if you're getting like a really, really fancy one. Um, that is a lot cheaper to make than an official music video. Uh, why you want to have this is that people, before the official video comes out, you'll see major labels do this all the time because they want more views. Um, the lyric video just comes out first and then they decide after they get the stats back on all their the music that comes out, which songs to make videos for. Uh, those it's just extra streams like people will still watch the official music video when it comes out but those extra streams from the lyric video if you didn't make one um then you would have just lost all those streams like some people just like watching lyric videos why not just give it to them it's super cheap to make those uh so just have that in your arsenal to make that lyric video now uh lyric videos do not perform as well for like social media advertisements they you can still pull them off for some youtube ads um, which we've, we've obviously run hundreds of those. So if you have not tried our YouTube promotion, click the link in this video, somewhere in the description, uh, omarfc.com, check out our YouTube promotion services. Uh, but the, they don't perform as well when you're running ads for Instagram ads or Facebook ads, because that running across the screen as an ad isn't really eye catching. Uh, so the other type of music video that we'll get to before the official ones is just filming yourself with your cell phone. Don't underestimate how many times people will click on an ad. If it just has good copywriting and good headlines, you'll see a bunch of ads on social media, just DIY videos, just a cell phone. People just filming themselves, uh, in their living room, their kitchen, their, you know, their, their car outside, wherever, uh, that, you obviously cost money to get the phone, but once you have it for, you know, three years, four years, however long you have your phone, um, you can keep using that. It has the cameras on there. The cameras get better every year, every iteration. Uh, they coming out with new technology now that you can have a blurred background. Obviously, it doesn't look as good as using like an official camera, uh, but you can still make those social media type videos with your phone. And we don't see enough artists do this. Most of the times we, we have artists uh, come to us for our Instagram ads management, Facebook ads management, uh, which you can also find that service on the same page at omarmc.com. Uh, they don't have these videos prepped. Like they don't have the videos of them just like filming themselves, re, you know, recording their music or cover songs or whatever. 
And we usually have to tell them, hey, you should make some of these videos so that we can run the ads for this. Uh, so, hint, hint, if you guys are, you know, you want to run your Instagram ads and whatnot, uh, have some of these videos ready so that they you don't have to spend more time making them uh, whenever you start to book your Instagram ads management with us. Now, uh, these... <laughs> These selfie style videos, uh, whatever you want to call them, also don't perform as well on YouTube. So th these all have their purposes. Uh, these videos don't perform as well on YouTube because you just have to think of it from the consumer point of view. When they're on YouTube, they typically do want to see their lyric video or the official video. Uh, sometimes you can have the album cover artwork, which is just a generated video from your distributor, like a distro kit or, you know, wherever you're distributing your music to core. Um, but when it gets to the official one, you kind of can't film that with your cell phone. They can work for social media ads on Instagram uh, and TikTok, but when it gets to the YouTube ones, you don't typically see those there as much. So how much do the official videos cost? Uh, it, it depends how you're doing it. All, all this depends. The DIY music videos, are, you can get them done for under a grand. Uh, zero to about a thousand dollars upwards if you're doing these high super budgets uh, if you're at a major label or something sometimes it can cost over fifty thousand uh, dollars and anywhere in between there as well so if realistically if you're not at a major label like you don't have a deal in place you're not going to be spending that type of money on the music video um D uh, just we'll run down the list of just how much it costs for for everything that you would need so if you're going to get a director outside of yourself it's you know 500 to two thousand dollars a day producer same thing 500 to 2k per day uh video editor it's this, this is an article from musician wave this says 500 to 1k per day you can find video editors for lower than that uh again from freelancers so this is all range but uh, visual effects artists, 75 to 150 per day. Screenwriters, 1K per projects approximately. You got actors. If you're getting other actors in there, if you're, they're not your friends or whatever, professional actors or dancers or whatever, 202K per day uh, for an actor. Wardrobe, 20 to 1K per outfit. Now, again, uh, some of you watching this might be saying who's spending a thousand bucks on an outfit, but if you're a major label artist, they sometimes just throw this money in there. Uh, because they get hundreds of millions or even billions of views on these videos, so they're going to make their money back. Uh, the camera can be 500 to 3.5K per day. Now, if you buy your own camera, um, if you have the money to buy your own camera, sometimes that can be a smart investment because uh, you like a, a good camera. Um, you can get one for about 750 we don't usually put our equipment in the videos but we use the sony zv1 we can try to find you know an amazon link to throw you guys that uh when we bought them they were around like 750 uh and they're they're specifically usually made for podcasting or you know doing youtube videos and whatnot but i've seen some online videos of them shooting with the zv1 obviously it was a professional but shooting with the zv1 versus you know some higher uh cost cameras and the zv1 still you can still shoot a good indie video with that um just to run down the list here for the rest of them lighting gear uh, this says 1k to 2k per day that depends on where you're shooting uh props approximately 1k possibly much more just depends location fees um 250 per day Obviously, it depends on depends. All this depends depends. Catering, uh, if you're gonna do catering, obviously that costs money, and then legal permits uh, if you need those. So those are just a bunch of things to consider. Now, obviously, there's a bunch of ways around that. This is all depending on your creativity. How creative do you want to be? You can be really creative with a lot of money. You can be really creative with a little bit of money. Just depends. What do you want to do? Uh, how do you want to use your creativity? So don't underestimate how much you can stretch a dollar with these music videos. Uh, but I went over the other two first because I wanted musicians to really start to do those because they, they don't cost as much and musicians don't do them that often. And you're they're losing streams, um, especially with the cell phone videos. 
because they don't do these. Uh, so you want to have those in your arsenal. But let me know what you guys think in the comments. How much have you spent on your music videos? Give each other some ideas on how to save money on that and how to use your dollar the most efficient way. We'll drop those links uh, that we talked about in the description section, or you can obviously go to marmfd.com, hit the products. If you're not subscribed already, click that subscribe button, hit the notification bell so you get updates on every new video, and uh, leave us a like on this. Helps us in the algorithm. I'll catch you in the next video.